So in this section, I'm gonna talk about using the channels tool set inside the Symphony Nitrous color corrector. So if I go to my color corrector, and, then I have, and now I have my Symphony color correction tool set, I'm gonna come up here, I'm gonna turn on my RGB parade so I can see my levels here, and I'll put on YC scope. Now I can look at my shot and I can obviously see this is really very green and I can look in my RGB parade and notice how, how really green this shot is. So in channels, what I'm gonna do is there's not a lot of detail in my blue channel. So I could go into curves like I did with Media Composer and do a pretty good job with this. But with channels, it gives me the ability to essentially blend the colors. I wanna blend the green into the red channel. So when I come over here, I'm gonna take my blue channel, I'm gonna add some of the green channel to the blue. So I type in a number here, right? And then I'm gonna to go to my red channel and I type in an, another number. Right now I went 2015, I'm just sort of guessing at this point. And I go to my red channel, I'm gonna take something from my green channel. Right, and so now I've done this very, very sort of big sweep in my color correction, and I'm able to take a shot that's really way out from, really needs a lot, a lot of work, and I sort of brought it back, and you could see very quickly on my, on my RGB parade where, I, where I'm at suddenly. And if I look here, right, here's my red input, here's my red output, right, you can see the information I've added there. There's been no change to the green, right? I haven't touched my green channel at all. And I look at my blue, boy, it's really dead. There's really no information there. And look what I ended up with. I have a ton more information. Now, honestly, I have something to work with and I can go to my curves and really do this fine tweaking. And so I would look at my, my RGB parade and I'd come to my blue and I would sort of start bringing this up, right? Bring a little bit of this down. And I would now come into this and I could use my my curves, right, additionally, right, and so this is very, very powerful in that I can make sort of big sweeps and channels and just do the tweaking and curves, is what's really where curves power is in this type of tweaking and fine detail, and I'm able to get there very, very fast with the Symphony tool set, and I'm able to just make huge sweeps, so shots that are just really way off, I'm able to bring back, and that's how you use channels inside of Symphony.